In this video, we will compare Webflow, Framer, and Figma. If you guys want to get started with either Webflow, Framer, or Figma, you can use the links given down in the description. Webflow is a web design tool that combines design, development, and hosting in one platform. It allows designers to create fully responsive websites visually, without writing code. Webflow provides a CMS for content management, e-commerce capabilities, and robust hosting solutions. It's ideal for designers who want to turn their designs into live websites with ease and have control over the entire process. If we talk about Webflow plans and pricing, there is a free plan, basic at $14, CMS at $23, business at $39, and an enterprise option for which you need to contact them. Framer is a prototyping tool that focuses on creating interactive and animated prototypes. It offers a high level of customization and interactivity, allowing designers to create realistic prototypes that can be shared and tested. Framer is perfect for designers who want to create complex interactions and animations, offering a more code-oriented approach compared to Webflow. For Framer, there is a free plan, mini at $5, basic at $15, pro at $30, and an enterprise plan that is custom. Figma is a collaborative design tool that excels in interface design and prototyping. It allows multiple users to work on a design simultaneously, making it ideal for team collaboration. Figma offers vector editing, prototyping, and design systems, and it integrates well with other tools. It's perfect for UI slash UX designers who need a versatile tool for both designing and prototyping with real-time collaboration. For Figma, there is a free plan, professional at $15, organization at $45, and enterprise at $75. Webflow is best for creating and launching responsive websites without coding. Framer excels in creating interactive and animated prototypes. And Figma is ideal for collaborative interface design and prototyping. The choice depends on your specific design and development needs. So that's a comparison between Webflow, Framer, and Figma. Make sure to use the links given down in the description to get started with either Webflow, Framer, or Figma. If this video was helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribe to my channel. With that being said, I'll see you in the next video.